You guys, it's holiday candle time. Hi guys, welcome back. Can you tell I'm excited? In today's video, I'm sharing with you a Bath & Body Works haul with candles, hand wash, body wash, all the things, stick around. So I've made no secret of my intense love of Bath & Body Works. We're going into Black Friday coming up. This is a haul that I purchased recently on some other sales, but keep in mind these things for your Black Friday shopping needs, gifts for your friends and family, for yourself. <laughs> or just, you know, having around the house. So let's get started with this haul. Okay, with cold and flu season upon us, let's start with hand wash and hand sanitizer. <laughs> so I really only picked up one hand sanitizer this time. This is one of my favorites that they make. This is the hand sanitizer spray, and this is the scent, the original. I didn't know that there was an original scent, so I was very intrigued, like what the heck is it? It just smells fresh, fresh and clean. So I love these hand sanitizer sprays because you can spray them on surfaces, you can spray them on hands, you can spray them on the inside of the mask that you wear if it's getting a little ripe, you know what I'm saying? Or maybe you dropped it, you can just give it a couple spritzes. I keep these in the cars, I keep these in bags, I keep these at work on my desk for the days that I do go in. Um, Bath & Body Works hand sanitizers are really the only ones that don't really just dry my hands out, so I love this. This is 550. Always check the Bath & Body Works site for specials. They are just rolling through hand sanitizer like gangbusters. Just keep looking. Just keep looking, but I love this one, 550. Next up, hand wash. So with any of the foaming hand soaps, these are my favorite, four for $20 or their regular price, 750 each. I did select four, but one of the scents, I guess, sold out before they could fulfill my order. They still gave me the special $5 each price instead of the 750, but I'll just have to reach out to them to replace the scent that sold out. So the ones that I did get, Twisted Peppermint, love this one. The notes on this one are cool peppermint, sugared snow, and aromatic balsam. I mean, it just smells like peppermint candy and I love it. So this is great. I mean, we are just, we're ripping through hand soap because you're washing your hands a million times a day and this keeps your hands moisturized and smelling lovely. It makes you want to wash your hands. <laughs> like anybody that doesn't want to wash their hands. I don't know what I'm talking about. The next scent is snowy peach berry. The notes on this one are snow-kissed cranberries, frosted peach blossom, and shimmering woods. The thing that I love the most also about the foaming hand soaps, aside from them being moisturizing on your hands and smelling really nice, is that they foam. They do have hand soaps that's like regular liquid soap if you prefer, but this one is you just get one pump, you just work it on your hands, sing happy birthday a couple times so that you wash your hands long enough and then you just rinse it right off. Love it. And then the last one is, so I'm so excited to see this one in body care. This is Sweater Weather. Sweater Weather has been a go-to candle scent or wallflower scent for me for a couple years now and now you can get it in hand wash which I love. So the notes on this one, if you're not familiar, are sage, eucalyptus, and fresh woods. It smells like what did I say before? Like the woods just did the laundry and took a shower. That's what it smells like. <laughs> so again, these are four for $20 or regular price $7.50 each. We love Bath & Body Works shower gel. It's our favorite. So you can always get body wash, buy two, get one free, or buy three, get two free. So of course I bought three to get my two free. And here's the scents that I chose. Same as the hand soaps, I got Twisted Peppermint and Sweater Weather. I was so excited. I had not seen Sweater Weather in a body care yet. So now I can wash my hands and smell like sweater weather. I can wash my body and smell like sweater weather. And then I can light a candle, plug it in the wall. Love it. <laughs> so good. All right. The third scent that I got is winter candy apple. This one is one that I really love, especially at Christmas time, because it just smells like delicious, yummy candy apple candy. So the notes on this one are candy red apple, winter rose petals, candied orange, maple leaf, and fresh cinnamon. This one just smells so, so good. I just love it. It's a treat. Here's another scent that I was super excited to see them add to the body care line. This has only ever been a candle scent before, as far as I'm aware. Champagne toast. Somebody tell Smoky Glow. <laughs> I know she loves champagne toast. So the notes on this one, oh, they didn't, they didn't put it on here. I guess they don't feel like they need to. It just smells sweet and yummy and champagne-y and delicious. 
I love it. And now you can wash yourself in it. So haha. -ha! This is a new scent for the holidays called You're the One. The fragrance notes are described as white birch, velvety rose, and a drop of strawberry nectar. It smells like lychee. You know what I mean? Like that fruit. Very fresh, very clean, very showery. I love it. I love it. So that's it for my shower gels. We go through a lot of shower gel. Now, here's the thing. Typically, on Black Friday, I'll go with my best good Judy, Sarah, and we go in person to Bath & Body Works and we buy all the things and it lasts us a pretty long time. The candles for me, not so much, but I typically will stock up on my body wash as well. But And I think I've actually given away a couple of these as gifts too, so my stock's a little bit low, so that's why I went ahead and got these. But we, we have tentatively planned our Black Friday visit, but with uh, coronavirus and COVID cases are really starting to pop, 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 like spike like crazy, so I'm not sure if it's gonna happen this year, so. Online it is, I guess. Oh wait, there's another one. One, two, three, four, five. Huh, well I bought six, because I guess I can't do math. Maybe there was a different sale? I don't remember, but Here's the other one that I bought. Oh, can you even see the label? It's called Snowflakes and Cashmere. The notes are described as vanilla, cashmere cream, caramel woods, and frosted clementine. This one, I really like a lot. It's warm and creamy smelling. It, it definitely is giving you like warm, cashmere, cozy sweater, fancy rich lady vibes. I love it. It smells really good. If they made this in like, like a body spray, I might be tempted to get it. So I love Bath & Body Works wallflowers. You plug them into the little warmer that goes right into the outlet. It warms the liquid, scents your entire room beautifully. What I tend to do with my wallflowers, in my house it's like a, it's a row home, right? So it's like very tall and skinny. So I sort of stage these wallflowers kind of on every level. I don't get all the same scent, but I try to get scents that make sense. <laughs> oh wow. With some of the candles that I got. So I got two scents on my wallflowers. Retail again for $7.50 each, but if you buy one, two, three, four, five, you can get them for $24 as a deal. So I got three of the Perfect Christmas and two of Peppermint Sugar Cookie. So the Perfect Christmas is described as fresh cut pine, cinnamon sugar, and toasted marshmallow. So it just smells wintry, Christmas tree-ish, but still warm. Sometimes pine scents can be a little too like medicinal almost. You're not gonna get that with this. And then with peppermint sugar cookie, it's exactly what you think it is. So it's crushed peppermint, vanilla extract, and creamy butter. Butter! I read butter as the note and I was like, yes. Give it to me. I also picked up a new wallflower for the holiday. This one is really cute. So my holiday decor is very like lodge, pine wood, lots of trees, buffalo check, flannel, fur. That's my vibe. So it's not country so much as it is like the woods. This one also has a light in it. The tree is sparkly as you can see. The wallflower just goes right up in here. You plug it in. Smells good, lights up your space. This retails for $14.50. They also have ones that are a little bit more inexpensive that aren't decorated. They're just very plain. They have the plain ones with the light in them. And they also, if you remember, Halloween, I have that haunted house projection. It projected a witch on a broom with a cat on the wall. They have one for the holidays. I wasn't able to get it online. It was sold out, of course, but I might wander into a store. Maybe if I can, I'll keep an eye out for it if I pick it up you know, I'll let you know. So I picked up all these candles when there was the recent um, $10 off three wick candle sale. I try to wait for sales. Sometimes I can't resist. Most times I can. There's either a buy one, get one free deal or there's a $10 off, which the math is kind of the same. So these were $10 off. So regular $24.50 each, but I got them for $14.50 each. So it's like I only bought six when I bought two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. I bought 12. About 12 candles. But it's like I only bought six, right? <laughs> first things first, it finally happened. One arrived broken. So whenever you buy candles from Bath & Body Works online, they arrive individually packaged very securely in individual cardboard boxes. You don't have to open them up to see what it is inside. There's like a cutout that shows the bottom of the candle that will tell you the name of it and the scent notes. I heard it. I'm like, oh no, that's broken glass. This has never happened to me before. Poor me. Look at this poor guy. Busted. Bah. Tragic. Tragic. 
While this one is fresh winter air, the scent notes are zesty citrus, fresh peppermint, cold evergreen. I smell the evergreen. I smell a little bit of a citrus note. I smell a lot of cardboard. I did contact Bath & Body Works and let them know that one of the items arrived broken and they have dispatched a replacement and told me to just keep and or throw this away and what I'm gonna do is very carefully get it out of here and then transfer this candle into, you know, a, a spent glass jar from another candle. I'll let you know how that goes. I just can't bring myself to throw this away. This beautiful, delightful treasure. It smells so good. It's not your fault that you're broken. I'll save you. Not bad though. I've been ordering candles online from Bath & Body Works for years and that's the very first one that's ever arrived broken, so not bad. Let's continue on that piney scent journey <laughs> and I'll show you what I picked up next. This one is called Frosted Forest. Love, love that container. So festive and pretty. I did notice that there was a lot more color tinting in the candles this season than I've seen in the past. Usually the candles are kind of all white, but I guess the holidays, they start tinting the candles. So I don't know that that does anything to the scent, but whatever. So this one is described as frosted juniper, icy eucalyptus, evergreen branches, and white spruce. Oh yeah, I definitely smell the white spruce. It smells like just woody, like bark. Oof. This one's gonna smell so good when it's burning. I bet you this one is gonna be like sweater weather, but more piney, if that makes sense. Very excited about this. The next one is called Tree Farm. I do quite like this container too. This definitely fits like my Christmas vibe in my house with this like birch and look at the little details. There's like a little truck with a tree in the back. So cute. Oh, I love it. Okay, so the scent notes are crisp pine needle, warm cedar, spiced apple. Mmm. <sighs> it smells like Christmas. So you're definitely getting a lot of bold pine scent and the cedar. You're getting that woodiness, but the apple kind of cuts through a little bit. This reminds me a lot of the candle from the fall called like something about a barn. It smells very similar to this. And I think it's the apple note that really brings that forward. But this one is a little bit more piney. Very excited, very pine, very Christmas tree-ish. This is the perfect Christmas. And look at that jar, so cute. With Santa and his rainy deers. <laughs> <laughs> Fresh cut pine, cinnamon sugar, toasted marshmallow. So this is the same as those three wallflowers that I got. So I got a candle and three wallflowers because I just want my whole house to smell like the perfect Christmas. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. When you walk into Michael's or Hobby Lobby, it smells like cinnamon. It is definitely like a sweeter cinnamon from that marshmallow note. Creamy, yummy Christmas drinks, but piney at the same time. And it really does just smell like Christmas in a jar, doesn't it? Okay, the next one, Holiday. I love this container with this beautiful buffalo check situation with a little bit of like gold worked into it. Gorgeous, gorgeous. The scent notes are red cinnamon stick, Christmas clove buds, ground nutmeg. Ooh, that's spicy. Mm, oh my God. So cinnamony. It's very, it smells like Red Hots, which duh, it's cinnamon. I love the scent of cinnamon. It's so Christmassy to me, right? Cinnamon, clove, and ground nutmeg. Oof, delicious. Now the next one is actually very similar to Holiday. Can you see it? It's called Christmas Cider. Wait, yeah, the jar is really cool because as it burns down, it's gonna create like a little window. The candle inside is like this creamy color. So you can see it behind the clear part of the glass. So as it melts down, you're gonna see the flame. It's gonna light up this little silhouette picture of these deer in the snow. So cute, so clever. The scent notes is mulled cinnamon, crushed clove, creamy nutmeg, simmering cider. So it's very similar in description to Holiday, but this one has like a more creamy, softer note. Yeah, this one is like cinnamon, like punch in the face of cinnamon. And then this one, it's got that more sweet cidery note. Does that make sense? These are gonna be actually very complimentary. This one's a little bit softer. This one's punch in the face. So this one would go well downstairs and this one would go well, like maybe up a little bit more to kind of mellow it out. You know what I'm saying? I'm always thinking about candle placement in my house. Like how can they work together? You know? This is a favorite of holiday scents, frosted cranberry. So I'm not normally a berries kind of a girl, but there's something about the scent of cranberry that is just so Christmas. And this one's actually very like Thanksgiving-ish to me. So this one's gonna get lit next week. 
rolling into Thanksgiving. The scent notes are iced cranberries, blonde woods, red apple, and tonka bean. That cranberry though. I want to take a spoon and scoop it out and eat it. <sighs> this one actually smells very bright and fruity and I bet it's that red, yeah, it's the red apple. Okay, now let's move into more like sweet smells, right? The next one up is, this is a classic, of course. This is Merry Cookie. So this is another one of those candles with that fun window design that I was telling you about earlier, whereas the candle melts down inside, this part of the glass is clear and you'll see the flame inside and it'll light up this little picture. And this one has chipmunk making a gingerbread house. So cute. So this is Merry Cookie and the notes are fresh baked cookies, sparkling sugar crystals, rich vanilla. So this is just a yummy, oh, it smells like just sugar cookies. Delicious. Oh my goodness. You know what I'm noticing too is that these little snowflakes are actually clear. So again, as the candle burns, it's gonna light up all those little snowflakes on the candle. Cute. I don't think I've seen that kind of design detail before and I love that. Next up is one that I'm very excited about. I wanna say that this is a new scent, but I could totally be wrong. Tell me if I'm wrong. This is salted caramel eggnog. They really did a great job with all of these candle designs, by the way, I love them. So the scent notes of this one are gooey caramel, fresh sea salt, dolce de leche, and sweet whipped cream. Bitch. Oh my God, that salt in there. It's just, it smells like salted caramel. Mmm, this one is really sweet. It's gonna be super strong. I can already tell. I can't wait to light this. Cold night, snuggled up, warm, hot, boozy something and cookies. This one's really sweet. If you're not into sweet candles, I would probably say pass on this one, but if you are into sweet scents, don't let this one go. Next is a nice holiday staple scent, spiced gingerbread. What I like about the way that this design is this year is that it's not like hokey pokey silly. You know what I mean? It's cute, but it still has a little bit of sophistication with this nice gold trim around the top. And there's like a little bit of a, like a wood grain, like a birch almost. Love that. Okay. So the scent notes for spiced gingerbread are vanilla icing, cinnamon sugar, fresh ground nutmeg. It's very spicy. It's not as spicy as that cinnamon one. This one's got a creamier note in it, but there's no apple-y stuff. God, it really does just smell like gingerbread. If you want to fool somebody into thinking that you were baking, <laughs> we have um, a couple more that are gonna go from sweet back into minty for the winter. So the next one, I'm really excited about this one. This one is peppermint sugar cookie. I love the label on this one. I love the color choices, this like minty green. So cute. Okay, so the scent notes of this one are crushed peppermint, vanilla extract, creamy butter, soft sugar cookies. So I got two of the wallflowers in this scent as well to pair with Perfect Christmas that has more like a piney type of a scent. It's a sugar cookie. Like you can, you can see it in your mind's eye. It's a beautiful sugar cookie with crushed peppermint on top. Oh my goodness, that's good. Okay, if you get no other Christmas candles this year, get this one. Ooh, that really scratches all the itches, doesn't it? Sweet, wintry, minty, holiday-ish, Christmassy, Hanukkah-y, <laughs> is that a word? It's not, none of those were words. Last but not least, this one is gonna take us from Christmassy sweet cookie smells back into just regular winterland. If I can make it that far, this one's called Frosted Spearmint. So the scent notes are frozen apple, snow-capped mint, creamy sandalwood, and iced musk. You're really getting that mint, but there's like a freshness, like almost a cologne-ish, like sweater weather vibes but sweeter and mintier. If sweater weather is maybe too masculine smelling for you, you want something a little sweeter and lighter, I would try this one. This is gonna give you all of those same kind of clean, fresh notes, but a little bit sweeter. I feel like I screamed through that, but it's because I'm so excited. You know I love candles, you know I love Bath & Body Works. Bath & Body Works call me. This is my haul for now. Make sure that you are signed up for Bath & Body Works emails. That's the best way to learn about all their sales when they happen because they don't tend to last very long. They happen a lot, but they just don't last for more than a couple days. So if you miss one, just hang out for a week or two, you're gonna get another sale. So I will list all of these items down in the description box, including the names of the scents that I talked about. So let me know down in the description box if any of the things that I talked about today are some of your favorites, or if I missed some. 
let me know because I am, you know, I'm all about some candles. I'm all about some scents. My Threadless storefront is linked down below in the description box. It includes this shirt and there might be some special designs coming soon. So keep an eye out for that. Thank you so much for hanging out today and for watching this video. I really appreciate it. If you want to see more videos like this one, then consider subscribing to this channel before you leave today. I upload new videos here on YouTube every Thursday and you can follow me on some of the other social channels. Everything's linked down below. Make sure you're following me on Instagram because anytime that there is a candle sale, especially at Bath and Body Works, if you don't want to sign up for their emails, just check my Instagram. I'll let you know about it. I am ready to wash all the hands and bodies and light all the candles. I will catch you next week in the next video. Bye! How many times am I going to say wash? Hope somebody's counting because I'm going to say it some more. Oh my God, focus, which is kind of, oh, gross. Hang on, I'm getting all my things ready. Oh, I did not gel my eyebrows, or did I? Wow, I can't talk, I'm so excited.